true confession time. All the time I was in Montserrat, tucking in a fresh fish every day, surrounded by fruit you could, you could just pick down off of the trees. Do you know all I could think about? Pie mash. You see what you've done to me? <sighs> I could make you a couple of jelly deals too, if you want. Oh, Jack Brannan. I've said it before, I'll say it again. You do know how to treat a lady. <laughs> <laughs> missed you. I missed you too. Mm. And I'm sorry about Sam, I really am. Mm. Just terrible timing. But now we've got a moment. There's a couple of things I think you should know. Specials are just being put on the board. Nice to see you, by the way. What the hell are you doing here? I don't know, just doing the rounds. What, didn't Jack tell you? I'm one of the owners. That's one of the things I wanted to talk to you about. What, that there's a rapist back on the square? All right, just be careful, yeah? Just because you pulled the wool over some jury's eyes doesn't mean anyone else bought it. And it's just a crying shame that Linda didn't report you as well before it was too late. Well, you were one of the few speaking out for me back oh, then. Oh, more for me then. Everyone else around here knows what you did. No, everyone knows what Linda said I did. Oh, here we go again. The same old story, is it? She just made it up. Wait, listen, maybe we should just leave it there, yeah? She believes it. In her head, everything happened just the way she said. And do you know why? Because it did. No, because it's the only way she can make sense of what she did. Oh, that's pathetic. I mean, I wasn't the only one, was I? And that's all I heard back then. Everyone kept going on about how Linda must be right because she'd have never cheated on Mick. Well, we know that's not true now, don't we? Just ask Max. How many others were there? Saint Linda? I don't think so. I recommend the jelly deals, by the way. Why didn't you tell me he was here? That's what I was going to talk to you about. What about when I was away? He was on holiday. I, I didn't want to spoil it for you. How could you even think about bringing me in here? Well, actually, that was your idea. <laughs> I didn't think he was working today. I checked with Ian. Well, you're still putting money in his pocket, whether he's here or not. Are, are you OK? Well, there ain't many other places we can go to, is there? Oh, what's that supposed to be? Oh. <laughs> I see. We can't exactly go to Walford East now, can we? Right. So that was breakfast, ruined, because of one low life. And now, no lunch, because of another. 